Here we are once again. We've really got to stop mating like this, you know. Sometimes I wonder what it's like to have normal sane person hobbies. I remember in kindergarten, they were like, what do you want to be when you grow up? You can become anything that you set your mind to. And I said, I want to build underwater cities for hamsters. And the teacher leaned in, got real close, and whispered, pick something else. Here I am in the sealant aisle once again. Oh, underwater hamsterology, why can't I quit you? Know what the price is. This is a liquid rubber sealant. There's plenty of sealants. They're probably chemically very similar. In the five to eight dollar range. Now let me show you something else. I wonder how much money I spend here in a year. Clearly I have a problem and I'm in need of intervention. Here is the Flex Seal. $90 for a can, or 30 for a small one. Phil Swift, you motherfucker. This is a hell of a hustle. I'm just mad I didn't think of it first. I think the stuff in the spray can is the same as the stuff in the paint style can, I think. I don't think they meaningfully differ. I think it's just the delivery. Um, I'm going to try the spray can. I'm also looking at 3M5200 sealant because that's what someone in the comments recommended. Instead of using one or the other, since you guys want to see Flex Seal be involved, I'm going to use the heavy duty sealant the other guy recommended and then I'm going to Flex Seal over it. Do you suppose somebody could waterproof an underwater city for hamsters with this stuff? No, I don't know. I have returned from the home improvement dungeon with the treasure! Weird flex, but okay. Oh, You stupid little goblin. You don't know any of this isn't normal. You're just a cat. No glasses this time because I want to talk about something serious. No, no glasses equals serious mode. Um, as you may have read on the Patreon in the most recent article, um, there was a death in the family, which is why uh, not much happens in this video other than buying the silicone sealant because between that time and when I made the rest of this video that you're watching now, I learned of my sister's death. And as you can imagine, that comes with a whole bunch of complicated feelings and uh, family preparations for the memorial and what to do with the body and things like that. So sorry to be a huge fucking downer. But, you know, sometimes real life intrudes into mad science underwater hamster land. Um, weird feels, man. Uh, I was not close with my sister. I don't really want to talk about this in this particular venue. It's not really appropriate for that. But uh, it has me thinking about death even more often than I normally do, which I assume everybody does that's normal right um, at least I have flex seal to keep me uh, company through this difficult time 